Derek Underwood was a very unusual bowler. He was left arm and round about medium pace, and about Tiger O'Reilly's pace, I'd reckon. Most times bowled around the wicket, although he could uh, bowl over as well. On a dry, wearing pitch, he was awkward, and on a wet pitch, such as at the Oval against the Australians in 1968, he could be absolutely devastating. Derek has already dismissed Redpath, and here he is now coming in to Ian Chappell. And that looked out certainly from here, and look at uh, Derek Underwood, absolutely thrilled. Given out by umpire Fag, a tremendous early blow for England. Doug Waters, the batsman, on one. That's out. Caught behind, and what a vicious delivery. Landing on or just outside leg stump and spinning shoulder high through to Alan Knott. Now Underwood at this end. To bowl to Mallet. He's out, caught. Caught by Brown. And that one lifted. Brown delighted, not a difficult catch. Ten men round the bat. Doesn't matter about the fours or sixes, runs don't matter at all. Ooh, he's out, is he caught? Look at Brown, look at Dave Brown, he's gone, and that was a better catch. More difficult because he had to go right, right low for it. 14 minutes to go and two wickets to fall. Underwood to Gleeson. Coming in round the wicket this time, Underwood. And he got him, bowled him, off stump, knocked out of the ground. And Australia are 120 for nine. Whole test series depending on this. Appeal, he's out! He's out, WW! England have won! And the series is drawn. 7 for 50 to Deadly Derrick. And then in 1972, on a headingly pitch struck down with Fusarium, he took another 10. First Keith Stackpole. Oh, and that's a fine ball, and it's out, caught behind. So the fifth ball of the first over after lunch. That's a quicker one, he's out LBW. That's the one push through with the arm. And really caught Greg Chapel unawares there. And that could be out, Illingworth's coming around under it. Should be out. Quite safe. Marsh caught Illingworth, bowled underwood trying to hit the left-hander down the ground. He caught him! A great catch by Ellingworth. It's out, outside edge, Dolivera. Red Chapel, that's spun back a long, long way. Stackpole is out week before wicket to Underwood. Look at that, Walters has gone. That one turn and lift in a fine catch by Parfit. Really gave Doug Walters little chance at all. That's Marsh now facing Derek Underwood. Asking for a catch and he's given him out caught behind and a little tickle. He's asking and he's given him out, a little tickle under the pad. Underwood on the hat-trick, two and two, and Verarity out for naught first ball. It's bowling. Spun from middle, hit off. And Lilly is the ninth we go down. And on to 1974 now, and against Pakistan at Lords, he took 13 for 71. Well, that's it. Caught at second slip for Gully. Underwood ball, turning and lifting. Zahir here pushing forward and the second wicket down. Sunshine in, helping the bowlers now. And that's another one. No chance at all there for Mushtaq. Turned, lifted. And Tony Gregg at silly point taking the catch. It could have got anywhere. It's gone away, miss this time. And it's not a no ball. I see Fikbar lost to go this time. Another wicket for Derek Underwood. Quicker ball by Underwood. That's good bowling, change of pace. Deserved that wicket into Carb. Too slow with the stroke. It's in the air, 
Tony Gregg, the man. What a tremendous catch. Now that must go down as one of the really great catches of all time. That must be close. That one came back with the arm. He had Zahir caught by Greg for one, and now it's Wasim Raja taking strike. And he's caught David Lloyd. Not a difficult catch, a good sharp effort by the Lancashire captain, and Wasim Raja not quite able to get over the top of that. Trying to play it down, but David Lloyd is very, very good around the corner there. And that is out of the glove. Asif caught at short point by Tony Gregg. Derek Underwood's fourth wicket. At a cost of 49. And he is as close to being unplayable as you'll see out there this afternoon. Oh, that's out. That's out and a really nasty delivery. The only thing umpire Elliott had to decide was whether or not it hit the hand or above the glove. And Imran Khan is the man given out with the total at uh, 200. Bowl him and Underwood has four for none in five overs. The last five overs, Derek Underwood has bowled. He has taken four wickets for no runs and he bowled into carb round his legs there. Thrust in the pad down, they got a little nick and it's out. Underwood took the final wicket, Wajimbari LBW for one, to give him eight for 51 and that match tally of 13 for 71.